Hey, Lou. Hello. Okay, if anyone has questions for Lou, you can go ahead and raise your hands. And we will kick things off with Nick Gallo with OKCThunder.com. Lou, uh, just wanted to find out what these uh, first few days of practice have been like and, and how excited you are to, to get back into that competitive mode. Uh, it's been really good. I mean, we got a, a great group of guys. There's a lot of new people, of course, but, uh, you know, we, we're ready to compete. Next, we'll go to Paris Lawson with OKCThunder.com. Hey, Lou, after, you know, last season and getting an opportunity to get on the floor a lot and really building up in that bubble your game, what was your focus this offseason and how you kind of wanted to expand your 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 game here in this new season? Uh, this offseason really was work on everything, you know, my, my whole game. You know, I noticed this year I'm going to have a, a bigger role, obviously. And, you know, it's really, play, I mean, work on everything, you know, consistency on my shot, you know, how to play a pick and roll and stuff like that. And I feel like I, I did a pretty good job this offseason. Next, we have Andrew Schlecht with Down to Down. Hey, Lou. Uh, I don't know how much you, you pay attention to kind of what goes online with, with Thunder fans, but you've kind of developed a pretty big uh, cult following online. Uh, I, just, I just wondering kind of your reaction to that and, and maybe your reaction to having so much success and then um, perhaps just getting a higher profile just just like on Twitter and on the internet as yeah. a whole. I mean, I saw a couple stuff. Some of my friends sent me some stuff, some stuff and it's, it's pretty funny, you know. And uh, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I'm happy that people actually like me and like my game and stuff. And, you know, I'm just happy. Thank you. We've got a Joe Masada with the Oklahoman. Hey, Lou, can you tell us when you were able to come back to practice and um, if you're willing, why you missed the first few days of camp? Uh, I mean, today was my first practice. Of course, there's a lot of stuff going on in the world. And uh, I mean, I'm just happy to be back. I'm just happy to be back. And, uh, you know, it was tough the, the, couple, the, the past couple of days. But, uh, you know, I, I, I took good care of myself. And, you know, I'm happy to be back. Thanks. Go to Jean-Francois Tremblay. Salut, Lugans. Comment ça va? Ça va bien, toi? Très bien, merci. Like <laughs> <laughs> uh, tout d'abord, uh, ça représente quoi pour toi que les jeunes uh, comme toi, Shea, Baisley, uh, semblaient un peu être le, le nouveau cœur de l'équipe? Uh, ça représente beaucoup. Uh, on était, on est, nous trois, on est vraiment proches. Puis l'année dernière, même uh, dans la bulle, on, on, était, on était souvent ensemble. Puis on ne s'attendait pas que ça arrive comme ça cette année, mais c'est devenu comme ça. So, on s'est parlé souvent uh, sur les réseaux sociaux, on s'est texté et tout. Puis you know, on est content de des joueurs qui étaient là l'année dernière, puis on est prêt à, à, à jouer cette année. Euh, au niveau de l'attaque, la, euh, au niveau des trois points, comment tu vois ton évolution de ça dans ton jeu, puis par un petit peu de tes autres focus à l'attaque? Ben, je suis beaucoup amélioré, c'est sûr que durant, durant le, le temps qu'on avait off, c'est quelque chose que j'ai pratiqué le plus. Puis euh, cette année, je sais que je vais avoir un, un plus gros rôle, puis je vais être prêt. N'importe quoi que le coach me demande de faire, je, je vais être prêt pour le faire, puis c'est sûr que, que je vais avoir un plus gros rôle. Merci. Next, we have Ryan Chapman with the franchise. Hey, Lou. So, Steven's obviously been known as kind of a vocal leader of the defense, specifically um, when, as long as he's been with the franchise. Is that something that you look to maybe pick up this season as that role is kind of up for grabs? Can you say that again? You're talking about, you said Steven? Yeah, so Steven, in years past, he's he's been really vocal on the defensive end of the floor. He's kind of been uh -huh. the, the leader on that end. Is that something, you know, obviously he's he's moved along, so is that something that you're looking forward to this season as, as taking more of a vocal role with the defense? Uh, yeah, of course. I mean, just the fact that, you know, I learned a lot last last season, and I, I, I did a pretty good job defensively, and I had some pretty good feedbacks. So, you know, I'm happy to to, 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 thought, to teach the, the, the other guys, the new guys, you know, uh, how to do the right stuff. And, you know, Mike, Mike Muscala was there last year, so, and he's pretty vocal too. So, obviously, he's, he's pretty vocal, you know, talking to me on – Defensive end. Awesome. Thank you, Lou. 